All right, day 95, live from Redondo Beach. 95 days in a row of walking at least one mile. I'll put the camera on, we'll get going. Ranger, say hello, Ranger. Meow, meow. You got nothing to say. He's already eaten too. No. That's, that's gonna be the extent of Ranger at the beginning. But if you wanna stick around to the end, We'll come back and see what he's doing at the end. All right, let's put the glasses on, get going here, start the timer. Ranger, you got to stay here, buddy. All right. Day 95. Let me start the timer. We'll get going. All right. Put in your guess how far I'll go, how long it'll take. I'm gonna walk by the car shop today, the American car shop, not the exotic car shop. Hopefully they have something good today. I've been by there in a little bit, so. We'll see what they have. I've seen all kinds of good cars over there. I saw a 53 Polo White Corvette. There's a inaugural year, first year ever they made those. That was a beautiful car. Had a glass plate over the license plate in the back. Beautiful. I saw a 48 factory yellow Lincoln Continental V12. Last year, I think they made the V12. Huge car. Looked like a tank. It's beautiful. Factory yellow. Uh, what else have I seen over there? 69, 69, or 68 Lincoln Continental. It's always there. I'm trying to sell it. It's been there like three or four months. <coughs> Good looking car. I saw a 60, 64 and a half Mustang. What it said, but officially it's 65 Mustang. It's like a maroon. It's beautiful. It's in great shape. I've seen all kinds of nice cars over there. You saw a 57 uh, Chevy, just the back of it, though. They really were working on it. So maybe they'll have something good today. I don't know. We'll see. So I always see something interesting on these walks. Never know what I'm going to see. I see, the other day I saw, I was in Manhattan Beach on uh, Sunday, saw Shaq's old house. That's where uh, Jared Goff lives now. That was interesting. It's a quarterback for the Detroit Lions. He was a quarterback for the Rams and he got traded. Now he's a quarterback for the <coughs> Lions, but I guess he obviously he's keeping his house here because he bought the lot next door, paid $10 million for the house, and I think he's gonna tear it down. At least that's what they say. I don't know. Check it out. I didn't really label it that well in the video, though. I, I recorded it, but I didn't know which house it was. I actually have the video right at it, but then I turned around and looked at the other side of the street and thought his house was on the other side of the street. <laughs> Uh-oh. What's going on over there? Cops, all kinds of cops. Kinds of stuff going on. See if I can cross the street. Go over there and see what's happening. I wanted to cross the street anyway. We'll see. This lady's getting ready to pull out. Where's she going? All right, get across the street here. See what's happening over here. See if the Cops direct me away from it. It's like they got somebody arrested. Oh boy, I don't know what's going on. Maybe it's DUI or speeding or maybe it's drug trafficking. Maybe he's selling cocaine or something. I don't know. Maybe there's two cops, right? Got a citation out. What's going on? Maybe it was a wreck. 
No, they got two cars pulled over, I think. Maybe it's just one car. Maybe they're gonna let them go. Looks like they're letting them go. So maybe it wasn't too awful. It's like a guy, it's a girl or something, a woman. She's speeding. I don't know. Maybe they ran a red light. It's two cops. Uh-oh. There they go. Off to get somebody else now. Oh, no. Look at them go. Whoa. Better get out of their way. They got to go pull somebody else over. Go for it. Man. Always something going on. Man, they were in a rush. Maybe they were going to go get the accomplice of the person they pulled over. I don't know. Never know what's going to happen around here. Always something. Whether good or bad, I never know what's going to happen on these walks. The other day, yesterday, it was kind of, it was a, a good, it's a cute little puppy I saw yesterday. That was fun. Yeah, working on this, just a 58 Mercedes. Hey! <laughs> hey, I know both of you guys. What is going on? Good. Yeah. How you doing? Good. Good, good. What are you recording get? this? Yeah. <laughs> I, I, got a, I record a YouTube uh, walk every day. Yeah. You wouldn't believe the things that I see. It's unbelievable. So a $16 million Ferrari the other day. Wow. Yeah, I saw a $150 million house the other day. It's unbelievable. Yeah, that's nice. Crazy stuff. So how you been? Good. Yeah, good, good. Getting the car service needs uh this is Denise's and we're we're going to Utah in, in about a week, so oh nice. You gotta come by and visit on a Friday. Yeah. You know, we're always sitting out there and uh, every Friday. They're always out there, so maybe when it gets warmer, uh, come out and play some, play some cornhole. Yeah. <laughs> Good to see you. Right, okay. <laughs> yeah, that was a good neighbor. Used to live in, in, our, in our neighborhood, moved out. Look at this, they're working on this. That's something. All right, there's the car shop. Wonder what they got going on over there. We'll walk back there on the way back. See what's going on. <clears throat> there's the 68 Lincoln over there. I've been trying to sell that car for three or four months. I don't think they're ever going to sell it. Maybe we'll get the phone number again, put it in here. If you like it, you can buy it. I'm sure they want to get a good deal on it by now. It's been trying to sell it for three or four months. See if they got any cars over there. It doesn't look like they had any vintage cars. Though. Oh, oh yeah, there's an old truck. We'll go by and see that. All right. It's from the 50s. All right. That'll be something. I saw a car from the truck from the 50s the other day. They repainted it and taking all the models off. I don't know if it was a Dodge or a Ford or a Chevy. It looked like about a 50, 55, 56. It's repainted. It was beautiful, but I don't know what, what, what it was. You can check it out and let me know. Let's go see what this one is. That one looked like about the same time period. Another from the 50s. So that'd be cool. There's always something on these walks. Every walk. You never know what you're gonna see. Timing on the There's something else is going on down there. I hear the sirens. There's something all the time. A bunch of roses. See a lot of nice flowers this year. There's a bright red something coming down here. Uh, 
Hello. See what this going on. There goes a Bronco. Gotta go see what this truck is. In the 50s. Look like. Always seeing something. <clears throat> Here comes the Lincoln. It's a 60, I think it's a 68. Lincoln Continental. Let's see if I can get the phone number here if you want to call about it. Been for sale for like four months. I, I tried to get the phone number before, but it's kind of hard to read. Maybe that's why they're not selling it. Let's see. It's a 69 Lincoln Continental Mark III. 310 3716-7055. 310-371-7055. 69 Lincoln Continental. Maybe you can call about it. I'm sure you could get a deal on it. You said it's been for sale like four months. It's a big car. Good looking car, 69 Lincoln. Seafoam green. Let's go take a look at this truck. See what year that truck is. No. How you doing? Is it all right if I look at the truck? truck. That's a that is a 50s truck. I don't know what year it is. Oh yeah. Uh, 57. So right if I take a look at it? <laughs> Fifty-seven. That's a, they made them out of steel back there. Those things are heavy. Look at that. Looks like it needs a paint job. Man, that looks heavy. V8. Man. Does that have any tail lights? Yeah, tail lights. Little bitty ones. Itty bitty tail lights all red on this side it's something covered up right there I don't know what it is GMC V8 ah. well, that's about it I guess working on an old 70s Cadillac like a scoop de bill. Now he's got something in here. This was a 70 early 70s Cadillac? Yeah. Yeah, it's a good looking car too. Oh an old Datsun today, huh? Yeah. Always something. Wow. Sporty Datsun 2000. Pretty good looking car for a Datsun. Have a good one. All right. Well, that was something. Fifty-seven GMC. I don't think I've seen one. I don't know what that was. It seemed like similar, close to the year of the car truck I saw on uh, Monday. That bit was same year, except it was sea foam green and white. And it had recently been repainted. That one needed a paint job. Seen better days. Oh boy, I have to, to walk down here for a minute. Thought I'd spend more time there, but walk down here, see if we see anything. Gotta get the mile in.
walk around the block. And walk down. But I didn't put in the guesses for the Teslas. I stopped counting the Teslas. I was seeing too many, like 20 a day. I don't think I've seen any muscle cars that I've counted. No dogs. I'm not counting Teslas anymore. It's too many. Well, if you're playing along, write down how many days in a row this is for you, whether it's just getting started, your five days, 10 days, you've already done 30, write it down. Come back every day, update it. It's day, what did I say, 95, I think. Two, one, two, three, yeah, two, three, four. 95 going for 100 days in a row i think i'll probably make it what's going on over here never know what you're going to see on these walks saw some police arresting somebody or giving them a ticket today they went tearing off after somebody else a nice motorcycle what is it oh that's that same motorcycle with the insignia that I didn't know what it was the other day. Oh, it's a Yamaha. Okay. I didn't know that was the insignia for, I see it, pretty good looking bike. So that's a Yamaha. So I've seen a Yamaha. There's a squirrel. I don't know if you can see him. There he goes up the tree. There he goes. Yamaha, Harley Davidson, BMW, Triumph. I saw that the other day next to that, uh, was that a 67? Oh, what was that? Uh, it's like an El Camino. I forgot the name of it now. I saw that, I think it was this past weekend, four or five days ago. I can't remember the name of it now. I'll think of it in a minute. But it looked really good. He had it painted cherry red. The whole the SU RV here, like from the 60s almost, definitely. Uh, I think it's got the door open and everything. All right, let's head back. Uh, yeah, painted cherry red. It's beautiful. He had a Triumph motorcycle too. I can't remember what the kind of car they call that. Ranchero. Yeah. That was beautiful. We saw it. He had a nice little friendly dog, too. And uh, what else did we see? Oh, we saw two uh, Indian Scout motorcycles. But you never see those. I've already seen two of them. That was pretty cool. So, just about seen every my motorcycle, major motorcycle brand, except for uh, Kawasaki, which I don't think they made for 30 or 40 years. I've seen most of the Major brands, BMW, Honda, of course, that was a Yamaha, so, always seeing something, a little half a car, you just want to go for a short ride or something, get a half a car, seen a few motors, uh, what do they call them? Uh, I guess we're just going to walk this way. Um, like golf carts, but they're not golf carts. I guess they just use them to ride around in the neighborhood. I saw a three-wheeler going down the road a couple days ago. So like a three-wheel golf cart or something. I couldn't, I don't know, it was on the video a couple days ago. Couldn't see it too well because it was going down the street. But I've seen a few of those, two, a couple of three-wheel motorcycles and then a three-wheel golf cart and two or three, three or four golf carts that people ride around the neighborhood in. You never know what you're going to see. About 
50, 50 Teslas today. I don't know if I saw any muscle cars at all. I wasn't really looking for them. To be honest, no dogs. An electric car, man, they don't make any noise. They just take off. Uh -oh. I can make this red light. Teslas as they sit here already. I probably see five as I before I cross the street. Yep, there's another one. That's three, four. Just looking for one more. It'll be five. Yep, there it is, right there in the white. Five Teslas within a six, 30 seconds. Unbelievable. Two right here together. <clears throat> Pretty much why I stopped counting. Too many. No muscle cars. Maybe I see one. We'll see. Another mile in the books. Every day. Well, if you haven't gotten started, subscribe, write down your goal if you want to try to do a half a mile a day, a mile a day. They say people with written goals are 10 times more likely to achieve their goals and people just think about it. If you've already started, write down where the most interesting place you've walked. That'd be, or maybe what the most interesting thing you've seen. That would be good. I had a bird eat from my hand. Saw a $15 million Ferrari. $150 million house. The remnants of a car wreck with ambulances. All kinds of stuff. Never know what you're gonna see. What is this thing? Is like a camper or something? truck with a camper maybe he yeah, sleeps in that thing or something I don't know a big truck maybe he uses it for work maybe he sleeps in it uh, I've seen that truck before I think he sleeps in it I don't know it's parked on a by the house a little while ago Look at that, look at the head, headlights on that. What is that? I don't know. Like a Halloween car. 15 more Teslas, but no muscle cars. There's a muscle car, one for the day. Mustang. All right. One muscle car. <sighs> well, always something on these walks. So people getting arrested or getting a ticket. We saw the 57 GMC truck yesterday. Saw the cute little puppy. Check that out. That was yesterday. Sunday was uh, Ranchero 50, uh, 67 beautiful Ranchero Triumph motorcycle. Another cute little dog. It's always something. You never know what, just 10 minutes, 10 minutes out, 10 minutes back. Saw the Beverly Hills uh, 90210 house, beach house. It's a few, that's about a month ago, I guess. It's always something. 
All right. Well, that was a pretty good little walk. Oh, yeah, some more red flowers blooming. Look at these roses. Coming out like crazy now. Whoa. It's going to be beautiful. Look at that. There's like a hundred of them getting ready to come out. We have so many beautiful roses this year. Some white ones already out, too. Look at all these blooms getting ready to come out. There's going to be hundreds of them. Look at that. Mostly red so far. All the white ones will come out. Beautiful. All right. Guess we'll go to one, walk down to the end of here and back to get to one, 1 1.2. I'm at 1.6 now, so not too much farther. It's a quick little walk, much nicer than it was, when was it? Yes, because yesterday it was really breezy day before so today it's nice probably about five degrees warmer shorts all right almost done do a turn around head back that'll be it for the day Check out some of the other videos. I'll put a recommendation or one you might like here at the end. And if you guessed 1.22 in 26 minutes and 13 seconds, you are the winner. Good guess. And that's it for today. Another successful walk in the books. 95 days in a row. What are the ranger doing? In his little hut. What are you doing, buddy? What are you doing? Yeah? Coming to say hello? Meow? It's a good boy, huh? That's it for today. Huh? I know I'm not sitting on your tail. <laughs> You're trying their best to get it underneath me. All right. Check out some of the other videos. Come back tomorrow. New videos every day at 10 a.m. That's it. See you tomorrow. Bye.